The passion for me in being a photographer, the overarching theme at this point is a connection with people, making those sorts of relationships and connections, learning the special way of developing relationships where you gain trust of subjects, having to earn over time and reputation and product trust that someone will let you into those moments and that's essential to all of it. My name is Mike Spencer and I am a photographer based in Somerville, Massachusetts. My path to photography started, I guess, relatively early in high school, but it was more of a hobby. So I was the photo editor for my yearbook, but I never took a photography class. I just was in the art room all day long, and so therefore by default I became the photo editor. But then through college and then a 12-year career in the corporate world, I lost touch with that part of myself. And I think that what happened was when I moved to Somerville, in 2006, I started to get to know the music community, um, which is very strong here. By watching other people do what they loved, I saw it as possible and it's kind of planted a seed that, well, maybe I could do that too. You can succeed and enjoy your time and your space in life. And so that was kind of where it germinated uh, to taking the chance to do that. There's a picture of a Husky and it's in Davis Square. And it was during the winter, I believe, of 2015 when it was an unbelievably brutal blizzard endlessly. And I was walking on the street taking street photographs of the snow and, and all sorts of uh, life that was trying to struggle through that storm. And I had reached a point of total exhaustion and freezing. I couldn't feel my hands. I quit. And I turned around and there was this dog sitting in the snow happier than anything in the world because he was loving it, just tied up sitting on the ground, just staring straight at me, laughing at me. And so I took this photograph of this dog outside in that terrible storm that I feel has always kind of sat with me and has kind of been a studio gallery showing favorite for people. One of the things that I like to do, I love to do street photography, but not in the traditional sense. I would shoot reflections of street life. And I was doing that for a while, and what it turned into really was a documenting of the changing, growing street life and the, the runs and the marches and the activities and the arts fairs. But I was doing it in the reflections of these businesses that had been there for generations. I have this wonderful studio space uh, in the Ames Envelope Factory. The room that I'm in is well over 100 years. Uh, it's been a bakery, it's been a wood shop. Uh, the wooden floors in the space show stains and burn marks from previous lives uh, that have done their business here. There's something really special about having a space and having a space with some history while you're working in a place with a lot of history that's also you know, evolving all the time. But by having a place uh, and being able to invite people into it to either see your work or to create work. Uh, I'm able to uh, explore establishing relationships with people from the community. Uh, and, I, and I really love when that happens. It's, um, it's something about having a studio that creates a, an atmosphere for people to appreciate art. And it's been a really important part of uh, my career as I've grown as a photographer.